All right, ladies and gents. Danky Kang here. Uh, so yesterday I posted a video of me and a few other comrades going and trolling the Turning Point USA booth at our local student organization fair IRL. And I received some comments on it. A lot of them were supportive, but then some of them were critical. People criticized me saying I should have done something else, that my responses were disappointing, or that she actually, you know, this guy says, kind of disappointing to be honest. She was pretty decent in her responses, and you guys didn't really get a good reaction. Well, okay, guys, here's, here's the deal. I also wanted to post this to Chapo Trap House, but since the fucking sub is quarantined, uh, I had to message the mod. And once again, got <clears throat> ladies and gentlemen, the mods are being fucking douchebags. All right, uh, this fucking dude won't let me post, even though I've posted to Chapo uh, in the past since I started this fucking channel. I've been posting to Trapo. Uh, I love Chapo Trap House. You know, it's one of my favorite fucking podcasts, and this doucher isn't letting me post my quality fucking memes on here. All right, it's it's not like I was making some kind of scathing fucking tell-all uh, denunciation of Turning Point USA. All right, I just wanted to to have some shits and giggles, go up to the Turning Point USA booth, and just fucking jeer at them and talk some shit. What, was I supposed to just run over there, uh, grab the corner of the table and throw it up and just spill all their stickers and banners and shit all over the place and run off like a, like a thief in the night? Yeah, cause that would go over really fucking well with campus security, which was all the fuck over the place. <laughs> Keep in mind, I wasn't masked. So, if I did something stupid like that, one, I would get myself arrested Two, the Progressive Student Alliance, the student organization that I was trying to uh, run and that me and my friends were trying to get up and started, it get nipped in the bud, ladies and gents, if we were caught doing any kind of real confrontation with the other student orgs at the org fair. So, yeah. And then another real uh, a monkey wrench thrown into this situation ladies and gentlemen, is that I have anxiety. It's not easy for me to put myself out there. It's not easy for me to even make these videos sometimes. But you know what? I had fun going up to the Turning Point USA booth and trolling them in real life. I got over my fucking fears. I didn't let my anxiety hold me back from doing some Praxis IRL. And even though I didn't go and destroy their fucking booth or whatever you idiots wanted me to do, uh, I did give her a copy of the Communist Manifesto. I trolled the shit out of them, alright? So, I messaged the mod. I was like, you know, hey, dude, can I post on the Chapo subreddit? And this doucher says, I'm so glad you couldn't post this. The system works. Oh, what? Was my tanky content too fucking spicy for your subreddit or something? You fucking chode? Or or what? Why, could, why couldn't I post this? I posted my past videos on, to this channel. Shit, I thought, you got, I thought the Chapo bros would get a kick out of seeing somebody go up to the Turning Point USA booth and just talking some shit. I made a joke about how Charlie Kirk should go get more diapers. Uh, you know, I called them out about their stupid uh, Israel stickers and all that shit. But I guess since I didn't just, like, I don't know, fucking throw a milkshake at the girl and, and destroy her booth, suddenly I'm not cool enough. Sorry, I have anxiety. Uh, fucking asshole. So, yeah. He says the system works. Well, the system's not... How's the system working out for fucking Chapo Trap House right now? Let's check it out, ladies and gents. Because it's a fucking quarantine subreddit. 
It's restricted due to significant issues with reporting and addressing violations of the Reddit content policy. So, <laughs> it's got 140,569 readers. I would have liked to have posted my joke here, but, you know, let's just see what other kinds of fucking quality content they allow. Let's go to the top. Let's go to the top of, uh, let's go to the top of the week, just to see. I mean, David Koch is dead. They're posting tweets from Bernie. I mean, what? You can post, you post this, but I can't post my Turning Point USA trolling video? Like, what the flying fuck is up with you? So yeah, the mod of the Chapo Trap House, you can go fuck yourself. Uh, I love the podcast, but this fucking subreddit's gonna die, especially if you keep denying people like me, who are just honest, original content posters, wanna come here, uh, make some, you know, memes. They're not meant to be like scathing fucking critiques. They're not meant to be like fancy or anything like that. There's n absolutely nothing fancy about my content. But uh, shout out to this guy Zaroden. He says, Dinky King's doing the Lord's work. Thank you, Zaroden. At least some person appreciates what I was trying to do here. Um, this is on Beard Tube. Uh, guy says, This is bad. So, I mean, you know. <sighs> Here's the deal, friend. I know it's bad. I know it's bad. I'm an awkward motherfucker. You see me in real life. I'm an awkward motherfucker. All right? I'm not going to be some suave fucking charismatic dude. All right? I'm going to be an awkward, bumbling, weird piece of shit because that's who I am. IRL. I have anxiety, dude. I don't do well in social situations. I'd like to think I did pretty fucking good considering, you know, I was confronting, like, my mortal fucking enemies right here. So, yeah, I mean, just in conclusion, ladies and gentlemen, uh, I enjoyed trolling TPUSA. Hopefully it's not the last video I troll TPUSA, but obviously there's some people out there that don't like my content. And, uh, yeah, it's disappointing to see, but perhaps the most disappointing one was the mod of the Chapo subreddit fucking denying me. All right, I, and see, here's the thing that really pisses me off. I was already banned from r slash fuck the alt-right, another subreddit that I would love to post my content to. Because I was a member of Chapo Trap House. Because I posted to Chapo Trap House. I am not allowed to post to this subreddit now. But now, I'm not allowed to post to Chapo Trap House anymore. So it's like, you guys double fucked me. You guys double fucked me. I'll fucking post this shit to more tanky Trapo. And they'll probably like it over there. Because at least they're not fucking assholes. Or at least I hope not. So if anybody on uh, more tanky trapo sees this, you know, be gentle, senpai. I've got anxiety. Don't, you know, at least I'm out doing something. At least I'm out doing something in real life. And I'm not just sitting fucking around on the internet, you know, in my underwear, just shit posting all day. At least I got that out there in the jungle. Out here in the field, I fight for my motherfucking meals. All right, so at least I'm out here doing something. Be you guys, the mods of Chapo Trap House, you're the fucking armchair socialist. Oh, what do you do? You read theory and you don't do jack shit about it. Fucking useless. At least I'm out here, a boots on the ground, trying to get some shit done. You fucking lazy bastards, and you're gonna criticize me. Well, let's see you do better, motherfucker. Let's see you post a video of trolling the uh, TPUSA booth at your local student organization fair. And let's see if you can give them more shit than I could. Uh, I would like to extend that challenge to pretty much anybody who hates Turning Point USA. Do, uh, uh, one up me, friends. Do it. I set the bar. It's up to you guys to raise that bar now. Uh, that's all I'm saying.